Hello and good evening. That was actually the chair. I know what you're gonna say. Oh my God, I can't believe you did that on camera. No, that was actually the chair. Can't do nothing about it. Anyway, welcome to the channel. Parked up anywhere, it's Larry. Yes, more van that on the way and it's a JNO2. This is actually a diss to a guy, to a rapper called G Debit, if I'm not mistaken. Is it G Debit or G Debit? I can't. Mm. Let me know. I didn't realize that Vanda actually had competitors, to be honest. I thought he just, everyone worked for him or he owned the music industry in Cambodia. I didn't know he had enemies. So, uh, yeah, you need to let me know that. And if there's a beef series, I want to know about it. So, okay. Well, here we go. Now we're talking. More watching. Let's get to it. Are we recording now? Here we are, here we are. Let's go, let's go. Um, so JNO1, I actually released that a couple of, uh, earlier on, so that should be in uh, uh, on the channel. And this is JNO2, so let's go. I mean, just the beat itself, it already sounds like a beat that you'd murder someone to, you know what I mean? Like a beat that you would diss someone on. Filthy. I don't give a fuck about a motherfucking name. Bitch, I'm living good, eating good, dropping bangers. Stop that, that's for even chain, but... He is dropping bangers, by the way. If, if you think he's not, then you need to go listen to the Skull 2 album. Um, go listen to... Oh, what is that? Elevated, I think. I think the track got... No, it's not Elevated. Is it Elevated? What is that track? Oh, man, it's just come out as well. It's actually my favourite track from uh, from the Skull 2 album. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find out because that's what we do here. That's what we do. What's to find out? What's to find out? Skull 2. Let's go. Yeah. Coda, that's it, that's it, Coda, that was it. Um, that's definitely one of my favorite tracks on there, by the way. Coda, go check it out. Here we go, and he's dropping bangers. I don't give a fuck about a motherfucking hater. Bitch, I'm living good, eating good, dropping bangers. Stop that, that's for him and chain, but she did it bad. I can't put a towel, put a troll in my side. I don't give a fuck about a motherfucking hater. Bitch, I'm living good, eating good, dropping bangers. Stop that, that's for him and chain, but she Right, Vanda is about to like literally skin this guy. I'm just kidding, I don't know if he's gonna skin him or not, but this is Vanda, like, this is why I love Vanda, and this is why I still prefer my favorite track from Vanda is Khmer Blood because I thought it was such a lyrical track, and that's what I love about Vanda. He can sing, he can do different flows, that kind of stuff, but for me, I just prefer the rapping. Uh, sorry, I love the rapping more, not prefer it, but I love it more. Because um, most Vanda tracks are just sick anyway. Don't look after my don't look at my footprints, bro. Like, that's so good, like you know what I mean? That's such a good line. Wait, hold on a second, hold on a second. It's the root because I'm Da Roots, like the roots on it. Catch me if you can, again, Vanda track, so brilliant, it just fits in so nicely here. Catch me if you can catch me if you can catch me I'm down and I'm high some complex that sing yeah I'm done but you don't need all them sore but you don't need to run but you play it till they go and mean the law make the thing is Vanda can say that because he does most of his own tracks and it's brilliant it's that's why he is loved and appreciated so much because again, to have that, it's real talent. 
And look, anyone can produce beats. Anyone can produce beats. Ask me. I know. <laughs> anyone can produce beats, but you, it honestly takes a special talent to like to compose a beat. You know, it's like like creation and composing. Yes, they will sound the same, but they are different things. They are such different things. Um, so yes, most people can create, but only a few could compose and make it just. And Vander can compose because again, he knows how to capture that feeling and. Especially in the tracks like uh, Time to Rise was was another that's one of the best sort of beats because he incorporated uh, Traditional musical instruments and again, he does that not just because He can but because he wants to experiment and bring that part of tradition into into the 21st century It's great. It's great to see Time to Rise another great track <laughs> <sighs> it's, it's, I don't want to say it's rare to hear Van Dyke rap because that's not rare, but when he goes in like this a little bit more on the hardcore side, I feel like he does a lot better because, because I, I've got this feeling where I think Van Dyke knows that he is obviously the best in Cambodia. That's fine. But he doesn't, he's not the guy to sort of, you know, throw that in people's faces. Now, when someone comes at him, I believe that he, that's where he's like, well, fucking bullshit. Like, I've been trying to help people out here, trying to put Cambodia on the map, and these men want to go after me. That's where he gets pissed off, and that's where he gets a little bit like, like he's about to do here. In this little, uh, in this little verse. Because if you bite me, I'll make you regret it like you're chewing on lead. Sick line. Oh, that's what Joe means, pretentious. Shit, I asked this question on the uh, on the first Joe video, and I, I asked what it meant, and pretentious bastard, that's what it actually means. Bro, why are you so Joe? Nice. 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 Why you so Joe? No man ton chop like whoa. Who knew they pay, but they couldn't let you see no. Toy night, boy, your nice boy, you can't make grow. Snap high, my nigga can be chung rotting the studio. Why you so Joe? No man ton chop like why? Put the wrong eye, chop the poor, climb, climb. Me and I'm boiling, drop top on and then see my bum bum bum. Talk on late, baby, high pay, but man ton change your the chai chai. Oh, oh, wait, 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 there was a couple of good lines in there. Come on, brother, back is now he's a snake. ไอ้ชุดตะปัวคลายๆมีน้ํามวยเล่นรอบทับโอนั้นนั่งซีบายบ่มบ่องบายเอาออกเลยไปเวียให้เป๊ะบ่มันตอนเชิญอยู่ใน
that like he's literally he's just proven the point that I just made earlier like you know where he's helping out everyone and giving guidance to everyone that kind of stuff putting them on the map and then all of a sudden they just turn on him and it's like well you've you got the audacity to do that to me well I'm gonna end you and that's that's literally what he's saying like you know what's so cheap in asking what's so cheap about asking you gotta ask if you know what I mean it's it's the easiest thing to do especially if you're boys but you're so ill fated you dare stab me in the back. Do you see what I'm saying? Like, it's just... Ugh, honestly, brilliant. There you go. There you go. I have not heard this song before, by the way. Before you get out of my comments, like, oh, well, you've heard this before you analyzed. It's the first time reaction, like, every single one of my videos, right? This is... But you could... Thing is, this is the good thing with music, right? And this is where some people only listen to it just for the sake of listening to music. But for me personally, I like to analyze it. Not like a full on breakdown, but I like to analyze it. I want to know like his mind state when he's writing this. And again, even before he brought this lineup, he still like, you know, the mindset that he was in, this is where, this is where he was going to go. This is what it kind of reminded me because Vandal's not the type of guy to like put diss track after diss track. Like this is the first time I've heard a diss track from Vandal, I'll be honest with you. And the fact that he's put this out, I just feel like he's been pushed to the edge to put this out and just be like, you know what? You fucked me around enough. I'm gonna put this track out and I'm gonna end you now. <laughs> top of the commune, top of the village, brilliant. Whoa, 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 wait. So two, three years already, but you're still catching up to my footprints. Fair enough. <sighs> Beautiful. ហើយនៅឡើយតាមដានជើងខ្ញុំលោកនេះលោកនោះឆ្លៀតរត់ទៅបួសទីកសាញ្ញុំពេកហ៊ីនលោកឆ្នេរបាត់ស្ដាប់